hey guys welcome back to my channel so let's cut to the chase <laughs> i quit my job yes yes i said it i quit my job i've been working there for eight months now and i'm a young woman and you know i just had a lot of experience working there and overall it was great it paid well you know it was a stable job but there was one problem i hated the job i absolutely hated this job it was a job where i worked outside you know and i didn't like working outside especially in the cold climate that i live in it was too much and i actually wanted to leave my job for a long time now um, I had enough money saved up for a while to just to just leave, but I never left. And I know a lot of people are guilty of doing this, staying at a job that they're unhappy at just because it makes money. And my best friend been telling me for a while now, you know, do stuff that makes you happy. A lot of people, they just work jobs that makes them unhappy just because it makes them a lot of money. Now, I'm not saying um, you should quit your job if you really need it at the time. But I prepared myself and then I was like, yo, I'm done. Like, it was very, it was making me unhappy. And when you feel your job affecting your mental and emotional well-being, you know there's a problem. And then if there's anything you could do to change it, you should. So this painting is the first painting that I did. I, well, I kind of did it while I was still working. Actually, today's my last day, so oh my god, I'm I'm pretty anxious about it. But um, yeah, today's my last day. I worked on it yesterday, so I did it the day before my last day. And basically, this is a painting to just you know get everything out i'm done with this job now it's very freeing and i'm happy that i'll have a, a lot of free time to just work on my art and my channel um if you've seen some of my videos before i want to let you know if you're not an artist you know these videos they take a while they take hours to do so it'd be it's nice that i will have some more free time to really work on them now and get more content out because i'm a i'm a very hard working person i love to like put out videos for you and you know just let you guys see what's in my head anyways back to the job stuff now today's my last day you know if you see this in the future it's okay just wish me luck you know because i i feel anxiety sometimes i get anxious but i speaking of anxiety this is like the first decision that i made that i feel good about like every time i make a major decision i always doubt it like oh uh, should i do this should i do i'm really not good with making major decisions but this is the decision that i made and it's like i feel so great about it it's so relieving it's like yo you made the right choice girl thank god it feels so good like oh i never felt like this like i said i always feel doubtful about my actions like like if it was between choosing two pieces um of paint i would just be like ah, i don't know i don't know i'm always like that but this just feels right because it's a long time coming i wanted to leave for a while now but now it's basically me having the courage to leave and um you know i'll give some advice to any young person out there if you feel like you know you're not happy with your job and you have the ability to leave you know prepare yourself save some money and get out of there you don't because it can really affect your mental health working somewhere you don't like the job was great they actually gave me employee of the month two weeks ago that's that could tell you i'm a hard worker i have good worth ethic but it wasn't for me and i found myself being happy unhappy 
every day when I woke up, I wasn't happy, feeling sad, affecting my mood. When a job does that much to you, you know it's time to leave. Like I said, you, you can prepare yourself, get a next job. If you have a family, if you have bills, get a next job. Or just prepare yourself to, to be out of work for a few months by saving up. You could do it. Um... I want to tell you guys that you could do it. You don't have to stay at a job you don't love and if it's affecting your mental health. I'm young, but I, I, I have some knowledge for you guys. Um, yeah, so um, I'm really happy. Um, I'm going to take this time to focus on my mental health, focus on me, my emotional well-being. I'm going to sleep more because I've been waking up so freaking early. I've been waking up at 3 o'clock to go to work for 5.30 in the morning. So I'm going to enjoy my little sleep and, um, you know, go, you know, maybe get some counseling uh, and do a lot more painting. I can't wait for you guys to see more content. As you see, this video is 10, it should be like around 10 minutes. It's longer than my regular content. And I hope you guys enjoy it. But anyways, let's talk a little bit about this painting because I'm rambling about my life. Let's focus on what you're here to see. So this is an abstract painting. I try to do something because if you look at my work, they're mo mainly like things on cartoons, things I've seen, you know, very, more detailed work, more, you know, you have to be really defined with it this one is mainly um you know free it's free in art i wanted to do something to like clear my head not think too much of course it's a little detailed because i don't know somehow i always do a little bit of detailed stuff but it's you know it's more free than the work that i'm used to and the colors in it is actually based on my job the playground, a little bit of the colors are roughly based on it. So, yeah, I enjoyed making it as usual. I usually do, but I, I like doing abstract art because I, I usually don't do abstract art at all. So it was nice and it was freeing. I was listening to a song and it, it just made me feel like... Girl, you did the right thing. Focus on your, you. And actually, I got some backlash. <laughs> I got some backlash from the family about it. Like, no. They don't understand. Sometimes, they don't understand. Like, you got to focus on your mental health sometimes. If you're focused too much on what your family thinks or what your friends might think about you leaving your job, guess what you're unhappy and it took me years to realize this even when i realized it i would still do a lot for other people which i do i'm i'm very caring i still do a lot for a lot of people and i i will continue but there's a point where you're like at us in a certain aspect this is my life if i live a hundred percent my life for you and what you want my decisions you want me to do my decisions based on what you want i'm not going to be happy i'm making you happy while i'm unhappy at a certain point you got to focus on your happiness because i get sad sometimes and i don't like being sad okay no one does so if you could fix it you can and you know what's crazy i'm such a hard worker i already want to start working again but you know I already started applying to jobs and stuff like that. I just love working. Who doesn't love making money? And, uh, yeah, I love working. That job just wasn't the right one for me. So I finally got some courage and and said, um, I'm out of here. You know what's weird? When you worked at a job for a long period of time, you kind of feel obligated to keep staying there. Because that's what, how I felt. I felt like... You know, this is so routine. I do it every day. How can I leave? But you can. I want to let you know you can leave that job. Just prepare yourself. Have some money. Have a backup job. Or, you know, if you have enough money, take some time off. Because you don't want to be overstressed. 
okay so yeah i had so much fun making this i hope you enjoy my commentary i know i'm an art channel but i do a, i like to talk a lot and i hope you like listening to me talk I, I like to talk about a lot of different topics and what i'm going through maybe you guys can relate and know you're not alone yeah and i love you guys I love painting this as always. If you like it, like, share, and subscribe as usual. And I definitely will be back with another video because I have so much free time now. Definitely will be back. I love you guys. I love everybody who watch my videos. And I will always let you know that. Thanks so much for the support. I'm new, but I'm trying. I'm trying to be entertaining. You know, I'm starting off. Thanks so much for um, watching my videos. I really appreciate it. And as always, I'll be back with another video. Thanks. Bye.